tomorrow is an important thing for Rwanda and uh, the chairman of politicians. Um, recently in the state, the preparations are going better and the roads are getting better and better. So what is the update now uh, before the march? Yeah, I think uh, there has nothing changed uh, uh, on that. Um, we are preparing and uh, things are going well. Uh, team is doing well, so I think for uh, the match tomorrow, um, I'm positive um, to to show a good match and uh, yeah, a good match normally then also normally should bring the, a good result. Okay, and, uh, what should the fans expect from uh, from the boys and uh, from you as a coach? I mean that. Any message for them? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> they can expect that we uh, we will uh, try to to show them a, a good match uh, and a good fight. Um, I think it's necessary to uh, to start from the beginning uh, to show the opponents and also to show our spectators that uh, we will do everything to to win this match. If I may say now, uh, if I may go a bit uh, uh, on the other side, we are still uh, in the qualifications of uh, AFCON. And uh, today, the CAF disciplinary uh, body has uh, sanctioned Libya. And um, now it's, uh, it was a forfeit of a 3 0 uh, in favor of uh, Nigeria uh, based on the previous uh, treat mistreatment that. Uh, the, the team of Nigeria had to endure when they traveled through Libya. Um, do you have a say about about that decision? If it's fair or not, do you have anything to say? Um, I think, uh, in general, this is a good de decision because, uh, okay, m myself, I have experienced uh, maybe not as bad as the situation uh, of Nigeria, but uh, in a lot of host countries, uh, uh, the idea of uh, serving the guest well is not uh, ver on a high, very high standard, and that's normally how it should be. And uh, a lot of countries, uh, as I said, uh, are trying to. Um, confuse or however uh, the opponent team from the start on um, and uh, I think this is a good signal um, for everybody uh, that uh, these times should have been over and a new thinking have to uh, come as it has already been uh, for a long time now in Europe and in, in other uh, continents. Um, but in Africa, it's still happening in this way, and uh, for that, I think it's a good decision. Uh, does it favor to you? Does it favor Rwanda in any sense, or the the fight is on still on? Um, okay, uh, I think. Uh, Maybe the result would not have been 3-0, but uh, the chance that uh, Nigeria would have won this match uh, was there, and it was probably a good chance uh, that they will win. So um, nothing really would have changed uh, if uh, Nigeria would have played this match and they would have won, and now they they. Uh, Okay, they had to suffer, uh, and they got the, th the three points, uh, but I think also they would have got the three points if they have played the match. So this is uh, a situation or outcome uh, more or less expected, but now uh, through a, a different way and a decision through CAF. So um, I think for us there is still a chance to qualify, even it is uh, still <coughs> difficult. But uh, um, I think uh, the Benin team has to go to uh, uh, Libya now. And um, yeah, I think it will be a tough match for them there. And uh, 
Uh, but I, as I said, I think it's, it's still open and we still have a chance to go through.